This video presents the renewed graphical interface of the downspout object. Let's activate the object tool and open its settings dialog. Select the special constructions, accessory elements folder. Choose the downspout from the appearing objects. By clicking the tab page selector on the downspout settings panel, we can choose between style and dimensions or hangers settings. When choosing the style and dimensions, we can select from three different profile types – round, rectangular, or corrugated. The profile length and profile width, or profile diameter, can be set here as well. By checking the hangers checkbox, hangers will be added to the downspout. If the hangers checkbox is checked, the icon on its right becomes active. This button is the shortcut to the hangers tab page where you can set the positioning of hangers along the downspout's length. Hangers can be positioned in a custom distribution or in uniform distance. When selecting the uniform option in the hangers positioning field, we can set equal distances between hangers. When choosing the custom hanger positioning option, we can set individual values for any hanger. The set distances between hangers icon takes us to the dialog box where we can input individual values. In this example, let's type 1100 millimeters for the third field. The results are instantly visible in the preview window. Let's go back to the Style and Dimensions tab page now. With the help of the visual aids, we have options to modify the top cat angle, the downspout angle, and the length of the downspout. Let's choose the downspout complex from the objects now. The tab page selector reveals an extended number of options compared to the single downspout, such as offset, elbow, hangers, and head leader. On the Style and Dimensions tab page, we find the head leader checkbox. After it's checked, clicking the related shortcut icon on its right navigates us to the head leader tab page. This is where the head leader type can be modified for the downspout, as well as its width, depth, and height. By checking the guard checkbox, we can place the guard on top of the head leader in one step. Let's go back to the Style and Dimensions tab page and to the Offset option. By clicking its shortcut, the Offset panel appears, where we can set all of its parameters. In the same manner, after clicking on the elbow shortcut, we can also set the parameters for the downspout elbow. Please notice that besides the downspout complex, these objects can be found as individual library parts as well. For example, the downspout elbow object, which has the same settings as downspout complex. Downspout offset is another additional object with the same available settings represented as a single object, just like the gutter head leader object. With the help of the Downspout and Downspout Complex Object Settings interface, we can reach a more intuitive approach to quickly set up our objects. 